Hey guys, what's up? Spectre here, and I'm back with some information for all of you PvP fans out there. I'll be recapping some things that you may have heard in the reveal, but I've also got some juicy tidbits of news that you may have missed from interviews. As you may know, all PvP modes have been changed to 4v4 format, yes, even Trials. Bungie has not confirmed all the modes returning to Destiny 2, but Countdown is the new mode they showed off, and Luke Smith alluded to Control in an interview with the Fireteam chat crew from IGN. Luke also divulged the fact that Bungie is not making multi-purpose maps in Destiny 2, instead they're building maps for specific game modes, and if they find that they work on other modes, they'll be introduced into those rotations. They also squashed some dreams by saying no, no dedicated servers are coming to Destiny 2. But that does come with a few caveats. First, the move to 4v4 for most matches will help with lag issues, and they're changing the matchmaking algorithm to be connection-based. Now Luke Smith seemed to skirt the issue just a little bit on whether or not connection will be out skill matchmaking, but he said they're definitely placing more emphasis on connections to give everyone the best multiplayer experience. It also seems as though trials won't be available at launch, according to Mark Noseworthy, but Luke Smith immediately stepped in to say he couldn't imagine Destiny 2 shipping without a trials-like experience real soon. Private matches won't be available at launch either, although they will be integrated later. Grenades will be getting a nerf, and now the game will telegraph that you've looted special ammo and loaded a specific type of weapon, letting the enemy know what you're using so that they can figure out how to counter it. Overall, Bungie seems to be trying to make time to kill longer. Another little interesting bit of information is the change of the audio mix for PvP, letting players hear things like footsteps in order to hear the enemy better. Players will hear small details and have a better sense of sound, so you'll be able to hear things like whether your teammate or an enemy popped a super. Let me know what you think about these changes in the comments below, and I'll be back with more Destiny 2 news for you very soon. And as always, thanks for watching, guys.